After I should say the allegation first came to light about four years ago. Today, a priest with the Catholic Diocese of Pittsburgh was found not guilty of sexual assault. Royce Jones spoke with Bishop David Zubik about it tonight. Royce. Yeah, Ken, that not guilty verdict for Father Robert Sedolia was handed down by a jury today in Commonwealth Court. During a call with reporters, Bishop David Zubik said he feels relieved for the priest. Father Robert Sedolia, who has maintained his innocence throughout the entire legal process, was acquitted of all charges Monday, including indecent assault, sexual assault, and corruption of minors. It had been alleged that Sedolia abused a child in the 90s while he was the pastor of Our Lady of Joy Parish in Holiday Park. I think the important part of all of this is that we as American citizens trust in the, the scales of justice of our judicial system. Uh, and um, am grateful that uh, that and relief for Father Sadori that there's been this this outcome. The allegation surfaced in 2019 when Sedolia had most recently been serving as a priest administrator at churches in Clareton, West Mifflin, Jefferson Hills, and Pleasant Hills. While the case was in litigation, Sedolia was on administrative leave. I asked Bishop Zubik if Sedolia will be coming back to work. We have to close the loop by also informing the Holy See, Rome, about the situation, and then, and then uh, you know the thing that would happen next uh, after after we. Uh, consult with them is that in his faculties would be restored. Whether Sedolia, who is near retirement age, would even want to come back would be up to him. Regardless, with his faculties restored, he can now celebrate mass in public, put on clerical clothes, and identify himself as a priest again. The diocese also said Monday that the not guilty verdict checks with its own independent investigation it conducted into the alleged abuse. On the other hand, the group Survivors Network of Those Abused by Priests, also known as SNAP, told us, quote, it is shocking that jurors found Sedolia not guilty of these crimes despite the great work of the prosecutors we applaud and stand firmly in the belief of the victim in this case who bravely shared his truth while taking the stand and i did ask the bishop if he's spoken to sedolia since being acquitted today he said sedolia did call him but he was in a meeting the two were supposed to touch base sometime this evening royce jones katie k news